congrats. If you're watching this, you've probably built your startup to a point where you have some recurring revenue coming in. Now you need to ask yourself here the tough question. Should I pay myself? Will I pay myself? What's the right amount to pay myself? One of the things you need to take into consideration when you start paying yourself is opportunity costs. A great example is this to a mutual fund. Consider every time you pay yourself, you're taking away from another investment. That investment could bring you four, five, 10, 100X of return of investment, ROI, back into your company. All of a sudden, you could be paying yourself significantly more with more profit coming in than you prevented that opportunity by paying yourself. I'm not saying every situation is like this, but you need to take into consideration the opportunity you're taking away, potentially if you were to compensate yourself prematurely. Another thing to figure out when trying to pay yourself early on, and you should ask yourself this before you even begin your startup, what is your bare minimum essential cost of living? In essence, if you were to take away any of this, you would end up homeless or sacrificing quality of life that you could afford to live in. You need to identify this number before you start your company so that when you do start running your company, you can find that magic number and ensure you can pay yourself and live comfortably enough to put every other dollar back into your company. This doesn't mean paying yourself right from the get-go to get a more expensive car, a bigger house, any of that nonsense. Just the bare minimum necessary for living so you can focus on what you care about the most, your business.